Welcome. This is a useful breathing practice for temperature regulation. So the intention with this is to offer you a really efficient way to cool down. So it's particularly helpful during hot flushes. It's able to actually lower the temperature, at least of your tongue, your mouth, or your head, and possibly your throat, and possibly to let that coolness travel down through the body. You'll be able to feel it for yourself. And so I'm going to show you how to do it, and then we're going to practice so that you can get a, a rhythm going with your breathing. Effectively, it's the same technique as you might well have noticed that dogs use on a hot day. So on a hot day, a dog will pant. It will stick out its tongue and pant like that. The wetness on the tongue will cool down the air. As the air passes over the tongue and comes inside the dog's body, it gets cooled. Same principle as air conditioning units. So this is human air conditioning. And what it will do is allow you to let the air that enters your body be cooler than it would be if it was just coming in through your nostrils. So you need to be able to move your tongue. So I'm going to show you two different ways to do this. So the first way involves rolling the tip of the tongue right the way back and putting it under your upper teeth. So it looks like a little straw in air can come in through both ends, like this. You'll see, if I turn sideways, you'll be able to see the air coming in through the hole. And it's coming in through both ends of the tongue, over a wet tongue, and then as it comes in through your throat, it will cool you down. So that's one way to do it. What you do is you inhale, you relax the tongue, close the mouth, and then you exhale through the nostrils in a very relaxed way. So it looks quite funny. You have to smile a bit. And then exhale. Because if you smile, you can take the corners of your lips back. And then the air can come in through the ends of your tongue. If you keep with this, you might get a little bit of a sore, crampy tongue. So you need to relax it each time you exhale. Just relax the back of your neck back, ease back, settle back. So that's one way to do it, version one. Version two is if you can roll your tongue this way. You can make a straw. It's like you're drawing the air in through a straw. You need to breathe quite slowly so the air can get all the way from the end of your tongue at the front end back towards the back of your throat, bringing cool air with it. Okay, so if you have a go like that, rolling your tongue this way. Relax the tongue, breathe out through the nostrils, okay? So that's one way to do it. Uh, the first way is an easier way to do it if you can't roll your tongue this way. Not everybody can do this one. It's a genetic thing, some tongues do it, some tongues don't, but pretty much everyone will be able to do this one. You can also alternate between the two. All right, so I'm going to get the technique going, showing you alternating between the two, but you can choose whichever one you prefer and stick with that. I'm going to also let you have a feeling of a rhythm so that the breath in is about six seconds long and the breath out is about six seconds long, thereabouts, to get a bit of balance and also to give your tongue time to relax. If it feels a bit weird, just stop. Just let the tongue relax, close your lips and just breathe ordinarily. So I'm going to do about nine rounds, just showing you the technique now. Exhale through the nose, and then breathe in through the tongue, and exhale through the nose. Are we ready? And if it gets too much, you can just pause, you can just breathe through your nose every so often and you don't have to keep going. So we're gonna see how we go for around five minutes of breathing like this, whichever one you can alternate actually. If you like one and two, you can do both versions. Off we go, breathing in. Pausing, breathing out. You can alternate breathing in. And then breathing out. And carrying on at your own pace, whichever one suits you.
you can close your eyes if you like. <laughs> Relax the mouth on the exhale. Noticing the cool air coming in. And exhaling. See if you could carry your awareness in on the breath. All the way into the lungs. And then when you exhale, just settling back a little bit, relaxed. A bit like you could lean back a bit as you exhale, as it nice and soft, lovely. And breath coming in. And out through the nose. So you can get a little bit of a rhythm with it, maybe a few more times now, breathing in. Seeing if you carry your awareness all the way down to your lungs this time. And a few more. Notice the temperature may be changing inside the mouth, the throat and the lungs. Maybe just three more, whichever way you like to do it. Close your eyes the last couple, you can really feel the air coming right in. Allowing the last breath to come in, now really noticing the cool air coming in. And as you come to the, the tail end of the practice, just be in a place of noticing what's actually happened. So you may be able to just close your eyes and notice the tip of the tongue, the length of the tongue, notice any change in temperature through the tongue. Maybe be aware of any change in temperature inside the mouth, maybe through the back of the mouth down into the throat and the neck. You may even notice a change in temperature right the way down, maybe through the upper chest. You can also notice not just these physical changes of temperature, but perhaps a slight change in your way of being, your state of mind. You might feel a little cooler, calmer, more collected, because this is a very powerful technique. It really works. <laughs> and I encourage you just to be aware that you've got it at your disposal now. You can take it with you. Um, even just becoming aware of the breath can be a helpful calming strategy if you're not able to fall funny faces. You, know? <laughs> um, you can just be aware of the breath moving, but if you're able to get this breath happening with the tongue and the cooler air, you'll really notice a difference. So you can be cool, calm and collected wherever you go. All right, so you can take it with you.